and welcome to yet another unboxing of things. It's not candy this time. No, nope, not candy this time. It's maybe robots? Oh. Tell us the story Wait about me. this grand box. Can I have the knife? You may have the Kaha Giri. The Kaha Giri. The box cutter. Ah, so this box came to us from our Zeke friend in LA, Phil. It's kind of a colony-wide Christmas drop uh, from the homeland, so to speak. Sorry, I'm cutting my address off the top of here. <laughs> and um, I don't know what's in the box. And can I pull that off there? There it goes. It has been lovingly decorated. Mm, there we go. Long live the Queen of Space. Bless. Um, this is funny because this is like from where he works. This is from Bluefin. The box itself, the Joker Demon King of the Sixth Heaven. This was a case of those originally. I'm, I'm quite certain that's not what's in here. Um, but we're going to find out what is. Actually, let's put this on the floor. I'll put stuff on the table. Yeah. We're in the living room today. Super casual. So welcome to the living room of Nerd House. Their awesome red couch. Red table song. We live in that Zeke life. Okay, so. Cool. Is it worth reading? I was going over it first just to make sure there wasn't anything like super personal. Okay. Um, yeah, this box, this was part of a gift box given to me provided by Bandai Namco Collectibles in the industry. Although these gifts were often generous by the company, I honestly didn't intend to keep them. I figured I'd distribute some out to family and close friends in my Texas column. The rest of the spoils I intend to enjoy, enjoy for myself. From, uh, from Captain Phil of California Base. Sigzio! Sigzio! So, we have ads! Woohoo! This my this favorite! Box, but the box is not going to Because the G40 comes in a black. Oh, check it out, we got it! Scouters. We got some scouters. We got, oh, like, we got three different color scouters. There's oh yeah, there's one. a third one. Awesome! Oh, oh, oh that's so cool. Uh, Eric, my husband, and I are big fans of Dragon Ball, so that's really neat. Uh, this one I had seen from the peak, so this is exciting. Ooh, there's a Sailor Uranus. Oh, Joe's not getting that one. No, Zavik gets to keep that one. That's his original waifu. Uh, that's Sailor Venus. And what do we got? Oh! Ooh, Sailor Mercury! Da -da. Those are really cute. I don't have a lot of Sailor Mercury figures, so that's pretty cool. Ooh, a Tony's. It's Pearl! I mean... <laughs> <laughs> she's Bird Mom, she's a yeah. Tall Goose. Yeah. This is awesome. Yeah, I, I do not have that. Nor do you. Tall Goose is. So we'll, we'll fight over that one. Da -da. Ooh, cool. Oh, this is really neat. Oh my gosh! What is it? It's a uh, Gundam, uh, mostly Gundam 0083 Stardust Memory art book. And like, as a costumer, these kinds of old art books are just like salt. Oh yes! The solid gold! <laughs> I give you the uh, character sketches as cosplayers. Like, we live for this stuff. I actually have the Gundam character encyclopedia, surely. So I have all of this. Oh, this is so cool. I come with some really neat, like, chrome decals in the front Ooh. too. They're all still there. That's really neat. I love like when old uh, stuff like falls out of the back of a warehouse somewhere. I'm just like, <laughs> yes! There's some Hamal sketches. She appeared briefly in very briefly, briefly, like, like, very like for like a scene. Yeah, but it was enough that she got her own character sketch for the animation team. There's what? Here, here's outfit and drop. Yeah, it's just her regular old. Um, cool. I see some things Eric's gonna like. Oh yeah! Gosh, we can't really tell a pile here, dude. So we got Akuma and Ken Masters. These are uh, SH figure arts. Figures? Oh, wow, these are really cool. Yeah, and uh, consequently, Ken is one of Eric's favorite characters. And I mean, who doesn't love Akuma? He's just awesome. So that's really neat. One of the super cozy ones. I mostly own figures, not SH figure arts. Uh, I don't really have any leaders one way or the other. I have a lot of Figma's. I'm a big fan of the quality, so we kind of need to get to conform the comparable points. Oh, that's cool. It comes with a clear part of my token. Yeah. Oh, oh, wait, here's some more Sailor Moons. Oh, oh. Dang. 
Oh, because Uranus gotta have her. Gotta have her girlfriend. There's Sailor Neptune. Very important day. Sailor Mars. Mars. Uh huh, uh huh. That's Kat's favorite. Look at that. Put her over there. She can hang out with the Dragon Ball boys. She's okay with that. This is super cool. It's like a Haro in a robot. What is this? This is a uh, mobile Haro. There it goes. Mobile Haro. Yeah, see it? And, and like he's got all these hard points on there, so all the like new stuff that comes out, all the add on packs, you can <laughs> put them on there. Like they have a set of wings and you can bolt them onto the back and Yeah, you can even see on the front it's got this big peg hole so you can stick stuff on there too. That's pretty freaking silly and I love it. Like, Haro, quit playing around. Haro ain't playing around no mo. And then we've got the two last big things. Oh, we cool's gonna like that. Oh, that's cool. So that's a Transformers Thundercracker kit. I've never even seen a Transformers kit before. They came out the last couple of years. That's pretty cool. Nico is really into uh, Transformers, so... Good articulation with over 40 movable joints. Any pose can be set easily. What is that? <laughs> Ages 15 and up. At least 15. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at least 15. Quit this human you can't see me anymore. Some people are like, yes, Lord, we don't want to look at your face. And then final lastly... Final lastly... A counterpart. I have the... So the box art is kind of like... On this side, you have the uh, the new uh, 2.0 Alex over on this side, so at least the two box arts looks like they would be fighting each other. Oh, that's really cool! Like, and you have the Alex. I have the Alex. Oh man! Yeah. But they're different qualities. Like this is the new one country, mm -hmm. and then the Alex I have is a master. Oh, so the box is not the same size. No, I know the quality is not too different, but it's slightly different. It's slightly different. Well, man, that's a huge haul. Let's get this box out of here. Uh, get out of here. Out of here, box. That's a huge haul sent to us from our friends at the, in um, uh, California base. Me. Uh, courtesy, by proxy of Blue uh, <laughs> Distribution. <laughs> I tried really hard to make that book stay. Um, it didn't work. Oh, I left the mouse there the whole time. I mean, the mouse was not included. No, I do have two more books. Oh, more boxes! More boxes! Awesome, but I think we should wrap up this episode first. Oh, okay. Before we open more boxes. More boxes. But you know us, we've always got more boxes coming in. Look at all this cool stuff we got. Thanks, Phil. I will distribute this to the people of, uh, of Texas Colony, and it will bring them a uh, merry new year with your bots in that uh, Yes. <laughs> so, thank you guys so much for tuning in and checking out what was in the box this week. And as you heard, we're going to work on some more episodes of, I guess I'm calling it What's in the Box now. It's box. What's in the Box? I don't know. Um, and uh, thanks for joining us here at Access Communication and Entertainment. I'm the Queen of Space. I'm Zappa. And see, see ya. ya.